Nine two Chesapeake families are looking for a new place to call home after a massive house fire right before the holidays. This comes after firefighters rescued two kids who were trapped inside. News 3 reporter Nana Sanchez has more with what one of the families who says they've lost everything are still grateful about. My house caught on fire and I don't know what happened. Chesapeake firefighters are also trying to figure out what caused these flames here at the Maplewood apartment complex. Jacqueline Yaya is looking at what's left of what used to be her home. She was out running a quick errand nearby when she got the frightening call after one o'clock. All she could think about was her 13 year old brother, Angel, who was inside. He could have not make it. Thank God he made it out, but look, everything. He was in virtual class when he heard the fire alarm. I see smoke start coming out. So I said, okay, I have to get out the house. I opened the door and then I saw like really thick smoke like hit me in my face. Chesapeake firefighters rushed to the scene off of Airline Boulevard. We are told two children were trapped upstairs in an apartment above Angels. <laughs> Neighbors watch firefighters pull the children out of the home. I kind of wish that I knocked on their door, but you know, when I got out the house, the first thing I did was like run far away from the house. The kids are okay. Fire Officials say they were taken to the hospital with minor injuries. A firefighter also suffered minor injuries during the rescue. As the crews board up the windows and doors of both of these homes, this family has to figure out what's next. The fire also damaged their mother's car that was parked right outside. It sucks to lose everything, especially when you work so hard to get everything and can't even afford everything. This week was supposed to be one filled with celebration. His birthday is this Thursday too. He's about to turn 14. But they say it will still be one filled with Thanksgiving. You don't really understand like the, what the word grateful means until you like actually like lose everything. They may have lost everything, but this family still has each other. I'm just glad he's alive. In Chesapeake, Nana St. Bonsu, News 3. Jacqueline tells us the family will stay in a hotel tonight. The community started a GoFundMe page for the family. You can visit our website at WTKR.com to help.